So I'm looking at this article about the school shooting. The school shooter, the Texas gunman, 18-year-old kid. You know, this still doesn't, you know, give you a right to take a kid, take a bunch of these kids' lives. But in the, in the end, it's still wrong. So basically, I'm reading this article where they're saying that Texas young, this young kid was increasingly troubled, violent. He was also getting bullied in school, bullied for his speech, you know, for the way he speak and stuff like that. You know, it, it's, it's, he's bullied as a child. Um, I'm going to enter school. He was a, he said he was a lonely, uh, interior who was bullied over childhood speed impeach you know uh, still doesn't give you a right to do what you did but don't get me wrong don't get me wrong still wrong at the end of the day right let me say this if he was there to help him help stop the bullying None of this is going to happen. Because the more you bully somebody, the more you mistreat somebody, the more that of that anger and that that steam is going to keep piling up. The more you disrespect somebody, the more the steam's gonna keep powering back up. And then shit start to escalate more and more and more. And then it gets to the point when you continue to bully somebody that has an issue with themselves and they have problems that they can't change and they were and they were, you know, born with with speech problem or some types of disability, we have no control over that. We have no control of our skin color. We can't change ourselves. You know? But getting bullied constantly like that, and it gets to a point where a person basically snaps. But on top of that, he was racist too. At the same time. But at the same time, he's wrong for what he did. And it was also wrong for him to be bullied like that. Somebody should have stopped it. Somebody should have stopped it. There's not enough uh, principal stopping the bullying. There's not enough teachers stopping the bullying. They're not doing enough. The school system is not doing enough. Every time we, we try to tell the principal or we try to tell the teacher... Explain on what's going on. They end up taking the other person's side. You know, you know, how, you know how it go. You don't care about these kids, man. You don't care about the children. School system don't care about these kids, man. It's like kids. That's why kids off themselves can get bullied constantly in school. Because yeah, kids gotta be dealt with once again autism and they get bullied for that twenty four seven. And they they cry. And they got to deal with their pain. And once again, some of them off themselves. Or they just snap or do some crazy shit. You know? He was bullied as a child. And it made him become violent. Violent. See, this type of shit happens. These are the things that happen. But shit don't get done. But shit don't get done the way it's supposed to be get done. And people don't get the help they need. And they don't get the help... Where they're in a bad situation when they get bullied and stuff like that, when they get constantly hurt and antagonized and get, um, you know, instigated, they're, uh, you know, you know get, get constantly hurt, you know, constantly annoyed. 
this is the type. This this this, this is why things happen the way they happen. The way it happens. Shit like this happens because they get don't get the help they need. We are told they these these motherfuckers care. But do they really care? Do they really care? No, they don't. Just like just like just like they did to our little boy, that eleven year old boy Raheem. Tore that little boy up. Did nothing wrong. It's just crazy. Hey, my, let me know what you think, man. Hit that like button or subscribe button. But still wrong for what he did.